Well, I just wanted to say, I'm sure you have all heard of the nationwide campaign that is ongoing, whereby they're raising money for the ALS, and we've commonly referred to that as the Lou Gehrig's disease, a horrible neurological disease that uh, there's no cure for. And uh, over the past, what, week or 10 days that this has been going on, I think they've raised almost $50 million across the country now. And we think it's a very uh, noble cause to be raising money for. And this morning, Basin Electric received a challenge from our good friends uh, Don Franklin friend. and Chris Baumgartner uh, of uh, Innovative Energy Alliance. And they challenged our CEO and general manager, Paul Suka, to participate in this uh, fundraising event. Well, fortunately for Paul, he is in Wyoming or Colorado today and couldn't participate. And since uh, I am uh, apparently acting in his behalf when he's gone, uh, I am here emceeing the event today. With me. <laughs> On my right, of course, is uh, Mr. Ken Rudder, who has lots of experience working with water in washing cars for the previous fundraising event here at Basin Electric. The two practice runs this morning were fun. Yes, yes. And we've spent a lot of time rehearsing this. And of course, uh, Mike Eagle so graciously volunteered to participate in this uh, outstanding uh, fundraising event also. And of course, we can't uh, but pass on the challenge to somebody else. So we are asking that our friends in Mandan, NISC, who are, uh, and Mr. Vern Dosh, who is the uh, CEO of that organization, to uh, take on the challenge with him and uh, his staff to also raise money for this uh, worthwhile event. And uh, I believe the cooperatives have uh, raised so far about $2,500. And uh, we at Basin Electric are are uh, very glad to be participating in this uh, worthwhile event. So with that, uh, I think we will prepare ourselves for the inevitable here. <laughs> and I will pass the microphone off to Chris.